Wait for it. No, really, I think we're almost there. Hey guys, today I'm uh, hiking up the uh, House Mountain Trail up in Rockbridge County, just uh, just out near Lexington. To start the trail, you park at the trailhead down near some private property at the bottom of the road, and you have to hike up right past all that private property on a, a sort of a dirt forest road. And the dirt forest road goes up the mountain and it gradually gets ruddier and rockier. You follow that trail for quite a ways and it goes up at a pretty good little grade. And uh, until, you know, there's some ups and downs until you get to this point here where the trails branch. This is called the saddle. And if you go one way, you go to Little House Mountain. You go to the other way, you go to Big House Mountain. You go to House Mountain over here. Uh, I'm standing in a shelter that's right here at the crossroads of those two trails. There's a privy and a, a very nice AT style shelter right here, um, complete with graffiti and... Uh, a hiker box. Let's look around. So this shelter, it looks like this shelter is built in an old apple orchard. Um, it's pretty nice. It's nice as anything you'd find on the Appalachian Trail. There's a nice fire pit and there's another big fire pit down at the crossroads there where the kiosk is. Uh, there'd be a great spot to camp for Boy Scouts. There's plenty of room for tents. I'm just taking a break at the shelter and um, catch my breath for a minute and get a, get a drink of water. And then we're gonna head up this last little bit to the top of House Mountain. That trail after the shelter, well, before the shelter is challenging, but after the shelter on up to the top is no joke. There's no switchbacks, it's straight up the whole way. There's no switchbacks, it's straight up, straight up, straight up, and more up. Then when you look up ahead and see a blowdown and more up, you just wanna stop and throw the pack off and get a drink of water. I think we're almost there though. Kids, we made it to the top of House Mountain. It's pretty nice up here. It reminds me a lot of uh, Tinker Cliffs. Never been up here before. It's pretty nice. That was, that was one brutal climb on the way up here. Straight up, but as usual, you get the reward at the top.
no, we lucked out and got this whole place to ourselves for the sunset. Never thought I'd be up here alone for a sunset on a night as nice as this. Okay, well that was a super night up here on House Mountain. Beautiful, beautiful spot. Man, what a payoff. And just a beautiful, quiet night all alone up here on this hilltop. Wow. I have this, have this whole area. I had this whole area all to myself last night. It was a beautiful full moon last night and I just stayed out on the rocks and watched it till around midnight and uh, went back to my hammock, crawled in and went to sleep. And uh, it was a little windy, a little windy last night because um, it's just up here on this ridge like this, but um, went to sleep right away. It was nice. Got up about 5.30, caught the sunrise what I could through the trees over here. Um, the eastern facing side of this particular mountain that's kind of tree covered, but you could get glimpses of the sunrise through the through the trees. Okay, Cam, it's all broken down. I'm uh, sitting at the overlook again. I'm gonna have a little quick breakfast and then back down the trail. At least it's all downhill today. We're gonna have Justin's nut butter. Uh, piece of Cracker Barrel cheese and you knew it wait for it spam singles bam baby old spam singles I don't know who decided this stuff was good last childhood in a, in a, in a sealed package that is the taste of my childhood I ate so much spam growing up spam sandwich the taste of childhood. All right, and a day two. Uh, made it back to the truck. Glad to get that thing off my back. It's about 11 o'clock on Sunday, and uh, I'm gonna go get something cold to drink and head home.